hello what's up guys my name is Gazan Freli and in this video I'm going to show you how you can create a custom sidebar using Elementor and Elementor Pro uh, this video is actually the extension of my previous video which was actually based on how you can create your own blog post template and single post template using Elementor and Elementor Pro so if you haven't wa watched that video so far please go to that video and watch that video first and then you will be able to understand what i am doing in this video so by assuming that you already have watched that video let's get started so first thing that you have to do is to go to your dashboard and once the dashboard will be loaded you'll click on the templates and from here you'll click on add new and you'll click on select and create a new section and you can name it as sidebar and you can click on create template once you will click on create template the sidebar which will sidebar template actually will start loading so we basically do not want to use any of free build templates that Elementor Pro offers but instead we'll be going to create our own templates so this is going to be a really quick tutorial so for the first section of our sidebar what you can do is choose this single section and I already have decided that first of all I'll use some useful links into my sidebar and because of the color of the background you will not be able to see it but now you can see this kind of like see this so I'll have to change the colors just like this Next color should be like black, just like this. But I think we need a little bit more lighter color, just like this one. So make sure you do not use a two sections layout, we only need a single section layout, just like this. And I remove some margin. This is going to be the first section and after that I want some of the content contact infos to be appear so I'll duplicate this section I'll copy the content sorry I'll copy the contact info and then I'll copy these widgets actually and I'll paste them right below this and i'll copy this and paste its style to this section and then i'll remove this so once that is created what i want is to actually add some space there just like this so that we'll have some nice spacing between these widgets so what i want to do is to add a contact form as a widget here so i already have uh, copy and duplicated this section and i have this form created on my home page i'll copy this form and i'll paste this form right here and I'll delete these widgets and I'll name it as contact us just like this after that what you can do is to play around with some borders and I want to add some border radius like 15 pixel border radius to match the style of the theme that I'm following so once that is done, 
the next thing that you have to do is to click on this publish and then this template is created so once the template is created we'll go to the dashboard of your website and once again go to the templates and from the templates you will have to find the blog post template that you have created for your blog posts so i have this single post template as my blog post so i'll click on this edit with elementor once your blog post template will be loaded what i want is actually to duplicate this section and I want my main content area to be of 70% width and 30% for the sidebar. And now from there, you will have to search for template widget from Elementor Pro. And then you will paste that widget here. And from here, you will have to find out the template that we have created. And here we have the same template now you can see this is how our sidebar is appearing now you don't have to change the things in here whenever you want to edit your sidebar first of all update this template and if we go to the front end of our website and go to this blog and if we click on any of the posts you can see that we have our sidebar showing here so whenever you want to edit this sidebar you don't have to edit them directly from this so in order to edit that you will go to your dashboard and you will go to templates and then from templates you will have to find this sidebar template so in order to edit anything on that sidebar you will edit the things in this sidebar template and those updates will automatically appear in the sidebar of your front-end website so this is how you can create your sidebar using elementor and elementor pro if you like this video please consider subscribing to my youtube channel to stay updated for new content that i will post i'll see you in the next video thank you very much